everyone, it's Allison Flores from Musical Empowerment. Today I'm going to make a quick video to show you some ideas about how you can add some basic improv into your practicing routine and get creative with uh, what you're doing at home. Um, if you've got some extra time, if you want to shake things up, try some basic improv. No matter what you play, no matter what comfort level you're at, improv doesn't need to be scary and it's something you can do at a really basic level too. So. I've got a couple song suggestions that I just found from YouTube, so you can find your own as well if you want. Um, but I'll link a couple of these so you can get a starting point. This first one is just a basic drum beat, um, 90 beats per minute. So really simple thing. It's six minutes long, so you can give yourself a goal of you know trying to play along with half the video or so but you can start with even just your basic head joint or clapping or singing something. Um, I'm a flutist, so I am gonna use the flute as an example, but let's just start with playing quarter notes to the beat. Okay, so that's something you can kind of do as a warm up, get to feel the beat a little bit, see how the track's gonna go, and then you can try to add some more rhythms to it as you get See how it goes get creative again try it for as long as you want or we can also skip over and try another beat um, so this one is a little bit faster let's hear how this one's gonna go okay but same thing basic beat this one is definitely a little faster but now I'm gonna go ahead and add my whole instrument together here so you can hear what it sounds like to play it kind of with your normal instrument. Um, but at this point, I would say pick a scale, one that you feel really comfortable with, and just stick to the notes that are within that scale. Maybe even just pick two or three notes if you're still getting comfortable with this. Uh, see what happens. I'm not claiming to be very good at any, like I don't do this super often, but um, that's just an example of how you can get started. It doesn't have to be some sort of amazing groundbreaking solo. Um, it can just be fun and creative and let you try a couple different things out on, the, on your instrument. Okay, so that's a fun example. I've got one more to show you. This one, got a little more going on. There is a chord progression, so if you're gonna put notes to it, um, you're going to want to be aware of those. So this is for our more advanced improvers. So it's just got a little bit more than just the drum beat, if that's something that you're interested in. So give it a try. Get creative. Be silly. If you have other people that you're quarantined with who play an instrument, do something together. Try some call and response. Anyone can kind of clap or tap along um, and kind of be an additional percussion section. If you want to do something like that, have a little uh, concert going on in your living room or wherever you are. So thanks for watching. Uh, get creative. If you have other improv ideas, feel free to add them in our comments. And uh, thanks for watching.